right. Dang, this water is super clear. Nah. Let's try another spot. All right, y'all, so here we are. We are at the oceanfront, Croatan, and Christy is roughing it right now because it was raining, but now it's not. Mm -hmm. And Christy's going to bait up a live eel even though she doesn't know it. <laughs> All right, guys, when you're grabbing eel, you got to put sand on your hands if you don't have gloves because these jokers are slimy. All right. Nice. Got Mr. Eel hooked up. So I've got my uh, dual threat here. I've got my plastics with the swimming mullet and then I've got my little um, you know, suspending twitch bait. So, hopefully, we can get on them today. All right, y'all. So, no luck um, out on the jetties fishing the main bay. You know, we're actually gonna go down the road and feel like the fish might have pushed back into the inlets. So we're gonna do some, so we got our waders on. We're gonna do some wade fishing. Go try and uh, march around through the backwaters. All right, y'all, so this right here, we're fishing the back of the Lynn Haven, uh, Lynn Haven Inlet, Lynn Haven River. Fun fact, uh, I heard that this is the most northern place that the moss grows on the trees some nice grass grass flats oh we got some boats got another fisherman it's always a good sign There's one. Ooh, this guy feels a little bigger. Not bad. You got one, Cole? That's not a bad size. Right there. No, they're not. Nice trout. Cool. Whew. It's a decent sized trout, people. Uh. All right. Not bad. Pushing 14, 15. It's a cool little wade spot back in here, people. Ah, got kind of clearer water. A lot of these oyster beds. I'm getting hung up. 
So we've got clear water, a lot of oyster beds, and uh, I'm using this popping cork. And we've got a good current moving. It is low, oh, there's one, that's a good one. Low and outgoing tide. And looks like we found a nice little school of these guys. Still steady at about 14, 15 inches. And uh, we're looking for 20 plus. These are Berkeley Gulp Jerk Shads. And I've got a quarter ounce jig head on here. And that just creates like a cool darting motion. Oh man, tons of short, oh he wanted that one. Nice school of them over here. Whew, trout number four. Still not bad, you know, 14 inches. I'm not complaining. Not complaining, but we want the big one. He's pulling a little better. Get on up in here. Still the same, 14 inches. Let's get bigger. All right, you guys. This right here is some of my favorite type of fishing. Just being here in camo, you know, when it's cold, it's winter time, nobody's out fishing. They're all out hunting or doing whatever they're doing sipping hot chocolate or something but i love it because we're on the we're on the trout and we're gonna try and hit it hard and see if we can get on some big ones caught about 10. we've got a good school of them and we're just fishing this grass line back here we've got good moving water and uh it's awesome i'm stoked Ooh, smoked it Dink, thank you. Ain't even gotta touch you. You ain't even worth my time. It's seriously like every trout. Whoa, oh, yeah. He hit it hard. Seriously, like every trout in the Lenhaven just like went up in here. Not bad, not bad. Woo! He's good. All right, a little better. Probably 16 or 17, Cole. Yeah, he's good. He's got girth to him.
Yeah, he's real good. Ah, is he on? Yeah, he is. Ooh, not bad. Whoa! Oh! You crossed my line! <laughs> Man, this guy smoked it. I thought he was like huge. People, I promise you I'm not catching the same fish. These are different fish. That's how many fish we're catching. I think I got, we probably got time for like two more. What's that? Like a crankbait? Like a twitch bait? Yeah. <laughs> oh man, good thing I'm wearing waders. If I catch a fish, then that's like, oh. Oh, he hit it, and I wasn't even looking. Woo! Not bad. You sure? Yeah. Is it? You need any help? No, it's a good one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's a puppy drum. It's a puppy drum. Nice. You dog. Get that one on video. I know. Look at this. Puppy drum. Beautiful. That's right. Mr. Resident Puppy Drum. All right, y'all. So that right there wraps up good day at fishing, Cole and I. So we toured around Virginia Beach a little bit today, but it paid off. And our call paid off to get back to the backwaters and the inlets. And uh, hey, that just, uh, hopefully that, I know that motivates me to just keep fishing. You can't catch them, keep on fishing. Just keep trying to figure out the puzzle. So anyways, thanks for watching y'all and peace out.